Good day my fine squires. Today I'm bringing you a guide on the Cabbage Face Punch Bonanza. Now I can see your first question might be, where on earth is this trove of XP? Well, I think you'll find it just north of the Lumbridge Crater, where the Sarah Domin encampment used to be. So, let's bank all our items and hop into a game so we can give you a quick walkthrough on how to play. Chagex servers are just trying to uh, connect me into an instance now, and we'll be ready to go. Okay, so as you see here, I've not actually entered in the first round. I've entered further in at round three. This is why I started by gaining two points. Also, a key thing to note is that there's another two players in the game with me. Hence, by working together, we can aim to achieve more points. So, as you may have noticed, there's multiple ways of gaining points within the minigame. Those include skilling at the farming and mining plots or killing the monkey minions. Now, it's important to note that in a group of people, of two or more normally, it's way, way more efficient to kill the monkey minions because you can each get a hit in, kill it in three hits, and every single one of you gets the points. Whereas the farming and mining resources still take a decent amount of time when you're gathering them together. Now obviously, the main aim of the minigame is to gain as many points as possible so that you can really boost that amount of XP uh, you can get or other rewards you can get from the uh, reward shop. So just quickly here, I'm going to skip ahead, move from round four that I've just finished straight up to round 10. So as you might notice, we've just started this round and gone straight on the monkey minion because it's actually a really good way to gain some quick points, as I said. Uh, the Gorilla Guard there is jumping on me and I, and I actually still have my Stun Guard and two Flame Proofs abilities left, as you can see on the left. These abilities just help to uh, reduce damage you'll take, whether it be by making yourself invincible to the Flame Walls or by stopping the guards from being able to chase and attack you. And as you can see here, the guy just on my north just used Flame Proof to get through the wall, save himself a bit of damage, and we just both picked up a decent amount of Cabbage Trophies, got ourselves a decent amount of health. Other things you need to be looking out for while playing the game is just making sure when other players in the game are attacking the monkey minions that you really let let them get on the monkey minions. You try and get everyone to get as many cabbage points as they can because I mean it's only it's only just nice to help everyone out. And then a quick final note just to throw in here at the end of this match. Really do make sure you do enter the safe zone by the end of the countdown because that's a lot of points you're going to pick up especially 10 points just for the last round and as you can see here we've all picked up a decent amount of points which are actually doubled with the bonus so we can now pop into the shop and have a look at how many points we've got to spend and how much bonus experience we can get so if i was to whack that in mining that's 33k 392 in farming 18k not too bad and in Slayer, I could pick up 30k points. And those are at my levels, which are pretty bad at the moment. Um, pick up some Slayer tickets, which allow you to have a choice. Pick up some patch bombs, which can clear patches really quickly. It's There's a decent amount of good stuff in there. And there we have it, my fine knights of the realm. I believe that concludes this guide for the Cabbage Face Punch Bonanza. Just at the end here... Uh, throwing out a, a quick little clip that I recorded of me uh, achieving 70 in North Stats. Uh, thought it would be nice to just throw in here, have everyone uh, see how much of a noob I am. But yeah, I mean, it can show you how the bonus XP can really help out, especially with the boring skills like farming and the ones where you've not got that many seeds. Uh, yeah, so if you did like the video, please remember to leave a like, uh, comment if you've got any suggestions, and do subscribe.